back in the day, you never heard of such things happening. What has changed? Somebody needs to analyze, do an analysis. What is different? Nina Beckford went shopping at Walmart in Valley Stream Sunday with a heavy heart after learning about two mass shootings this weekend that left at least 29 people dead in less than 24 hours. This could happen anywhere. It could be my Walmart here. And um, of course, there was a sense of trepidation. The first one began at a Walmart in El Paso Saturday morning. 20 people lost their lives in Texas as they shopped. Over 20 were hurt. I just feel I feel awful inside. I, I just I just feel that everywhere you walk, you have to look over your shoulder. You really don't know what's going to happen from day to day. Then about 13 hours later, as the nation was already reeling from the alleged hatred attack in Texas, more carnage, this time in Dayton, Ohio. Just feel very bad for all the, all the lost lives and the people who were hurt and injured. It's a terrible tragedy. This weekend's bloodshed is being linked to possible hatred targeting mainly people of color and are at the hands of two men, one of whom authorities believe may be a white nationalist. It's just an awful, awful thing to happen in our nation. With more mass shootings in our country than days this year so far, the NYPD isn't taking any chances and has stepped up security. My heart was very heavy. Anytime I hear of such tragedies, I am overwhelmed with a sense of grief. We need to do something about the gun control. We need some, something needs to happen. It's just too many times we're having the same conversation.